Hi traders, this is Prakash Gaba here. Nifty view for 18th September 2020. Well, the Nifty surprise and open with a bear gap right on our support of 11,525. Climbed up to our resistance and could not climb up to our crucial support and somehow just could not hold and came down and has traded in the red. When I am looking at the chart, so far this one, indicator wise tells me the trend is still intact. But when I am looking at this view, the move from this place to this place, it is suggestive of an reactive move. To my mind, very strong resistance is here 11,661 that nut is not easy to crack because that's the strong resistance from 12,000 all time high to 7,500 March low this is a very stiff resistance and that is 11,661 I don't think it can go there I was hoping it will go closer to that and then turn around it did not go there anyway so far this move was weak <coughs> this up move also looks a reactive like the similar so very good chance maybe it will take few days this can come down here like this possible I will have to do the calculations go back to the drawing board and see how much it can come down so I will not do so but upside seems to be a bit struggle and a tire is going reluctant up that is the way I would look at Nifty. Let us look at Nifty internals. Well, Nifty internal is suggestive that it broke down the top out here and actually it opened at support, went up to this zone, the previous resistance out there, couldn't sustain and came down. Again, went up reactive up move and came down. So this move when I mark it out here is a weak move. The chart internally is weak. So in the process, I would assume that 11,575 zone is a stiff resistance zone to work with. So if you get rallies, those rallies are shortable rallies. As long as 11,575, 11,600 is not taken out. Downside is possible to maybe around these zones of 11,400 or even lower if it happens. Possibly these zones, 11,400, yes, 11,400 is the place it can come down to. The problem is if it opens the gap down, if it opens the gap green, then one can short it. But if it opens with the gap down in the red, somewhere closer to 11,400, we could see an up move to back around 11,500. So this is a bit tricky to trade. Everything depends on where it opens. So let's see about Nifty Bank. Now Nifty Bank is trapped. Seven trading sessions into a zone of 22,000 to 22,700. It needs to come out of it. Previous move is down. They are weak moves. Now if this 22,000 goes, who knows, we may even see 21,000 zones. So far, it looks weak. It's looking at pure structures. I speak about structures many times, but nobody knows what a structure is. My structure is different from what people speak, a normal structure. When I say a structure, it means that I can see a chart in one second, in under a second and come to know if it's strong or weak. Someday, I will write a book on that, structures. Anyway, this is Nifty Bank internals. When I am looking at Nifty Bank internals, upside will be there once it crosses 22,700. Until that happens, I would view any upside as shorty rallies. So far, it is sideways. And the first sign of I mean, upside to 22,700 will come once it starts to trade about 22,500. 
But if it breaks 23,300, it could even break 22,100 and then back to 22,000 zone, which is a very, very, very strong support zone to work with because it's a round figure. So Bank Nifty is a bit complicated stuff. It's too much of a mess around unless something massive up move comes in, some announcement opens up here and goes up, quite possible. But it's messy out here. Internally, I'm seeing a head and shoulder pattern here. If that happens, possibly we'll see even 22,000 coming in. The best thing to do is let me mark it out. If it opens in these zones, if it opens up in these zones, let me mark it out nicely. It'll be shorting opportunity. Let me tell you. Yeah. If it opens in these zones, it'll be shorting opportunities. That's all I will tell you. This is the zone I'm looking. I'll move. I'll move this circle. No, it's not being able to move. I'll draw another circle. If it opens in these zones, looks like it'll be a shorting opportunity. Better if it opens closer to twenty-two thousand five hundred. Let's see where it opens. Just remember one thing: trading is only about making money, nothing else. Trade what you see, not what you think. Trade the markets, not the forecasts, and yes, enjoy the ride.